Hi friend, this is Dr. Apoor Mehra and I represent Conceptual Orthopedics, an e-learning platform for the birding orthopedic residents and surgeons. And with me is Dr. Gautam Sinha, a budding orthopedic surgeon who has just cleared his DNB in orthopedics with a fantastic score. Before I go ahead, let us start this interview with the names of his parents. Gautam, the name of your parents, please. Yes, sir. Uh, my father's name is uh, Mr. Gopikanta Sinha and my mother's name is Mrs. Namita Sinha. Congratulations to the entire family and you, yeah. Gautam. Having a doctor in the family and that to an author. Thank you very much. Fantastic feeling. Sir. So you did your MBBS from which college? Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Sir, sir I did my MBBS from, uh, from Philippines, Kagain State University. Fantastic. And why orthopedics? Yes. Sir, uh, yeah, during my internship and I had my ortho, uh, orthopedic uh, rotation, uh, this was the subject which fascinated, fascinated me a lot, like the, the trauma part and the fixators and all, and the thrill to do a, a surgery in orthopedics. It was just awesome. So after that, after, after my internship, uh, I decided that uh, I will take up orthopedics. Right. So that was the reason. Fantastic, Gautam. And you did your DNB with a fantastic score of 180. 180 is always a great score out of 300. And I know each mark matters a lot. How was the pattern of the exam? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So the pattern is, uh, as we know, that it's, it's an OSCE pattern. And uh, <clears throat> the slides were... Uh, the, the examination slides which we got were like, uh, most of it were like, uh, I read it, uh, I have gone through in the app, the conceptual orthopedic app. It, directly or indirectly, uh, the teachers in conceptual orthopedic have uh, taught us all those things. It was, it was all covered in the, in the app. So, so you it helped me a lot. It relatable. You were able to relate in the exam with the content being delivered. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Fantastic. You know, I yes, always sir, tell it everybody. Was, it was very relatable. Yeah, I tell everybody the principles will stay the same. If you learn yes. the concepts, <clears throat> you will be able to apply them at every stage. Fantastic. Yes, sir, definitely. Sir. Fantastic. So, about conceptual orthopedics app, what is the yes, feature sir. you like more? The notes, the recorded lectures, or the live sessions? Sir, uh, everything was good, but the uh, recorded lectures were the, the best part because sometimes uh, we have duties and all the residents of duty, so we can always get back and uh, watch those uh, videos over and over again. So sometimes I used to watch it once or twice if I don't understand. Yes, sir. And who are the teachers that excited you in the app? Sir, the uh, best was uh, Dr. Shailas Pai. Fantastic. Being being inclined yes, towards trauma, joining orthopedics yes, with sir. trauma, with having a mentor like Dr. Shailesh is something yes, that is very energetic. Yes, How sir. were the yes. sessions with Dr. Dimri? I'll... So it was fantastic. Like the basic, uh, the basic senses from Dr. Dimri was like, it brushed up my concepts a lot. So it helped, eventually it helped me in the, in solving the OSCE questions. Even if, uh, even if some of the OSCE questions were new, but uh, if the basics were uh, uh, basics were uh, good, so we can solve it. Right. So, so Dr. Dimri's lectures helped helped me a lot. In fact, basic science is a basic word, but one of the most difficult things for an orthopedic surgeon. Trauma yes, sir, is yes, one of the things that we always need day in day out. Having two strong yes, teachers is always a boost to your confidence. Who are yes, the sir. other teachers that you that you liked while being in conceptual orthopedics? So all of them are best, but uh, Dr. Uh, <clears throat> Dr. Anil Dhal, the, the uh, microsurgical, the hand, then uh, his lectures were very good. And on the compartment syndrome, it was also very good. And uh, Dr. Sudhir, his fine lectures and his lectures on the uh, DDH and Parthis were also very good. Right. So and Dr. Like Matthew Dr. Berge, sir. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes, sir. Dr. His Anil lectures Dhal. on the, this. His lectures on Parthis was also one of the best. Fantastic. So Dr. Anil Dhal, Dr. Sudhir Kumar, 
Dr. Yes, Matthew sir. Vargas. So these were the teachers yes, who sir. invited you. How did you find our courses that we were organizing, the pediatric course, the sports injury course? How did you find these courses? Were you, were you, were you able to uh, cover a lot of topics with it? Yes, sir, definitely, definitely, sir. Like uh, after after uh, reading in the app and then uh, after uh, attending the lectures in the app, there was absolutely no need to again read a books. So everything was in the app. So I just have to open some videos and all the question papers and all the uh, notes are in the app. So it was very it was very nice and it was very helpful. And Gautam, how much time were you giving every day to the app? Sir, uh, I, I would give like around uh, four to five hours. Fantastic. And uh, was it yes. more towards the end when the exam was coming? Yes, it was more towards the end from uh, from July, the last two months. And and the daily OSCE sessions, did it help you finish it off? And I attended all the, yes, sir. I attended all the daily OSCE sessions. Then that was the main one of the, uh, main uh, factor and it helped us a lot it helped us to again brush the uh, brush up the topics and whatever we forget whatever i forget in the uh, in the lectures which i had ended before it was all covered up in those topics fantastic gautam what's your message yes. to your to your juniors regarding orthopedics how to approach the branch and how to approach the exams uh, so my uh, message will be first uh, the basics should be clear the basic is the most important one. The concepts and the basics should be very clear. And if the basics are clear, then we can eventually diagnose anything, not only in the exam, but also in our OPD and in our in our future uh, practice, sir. So exactly. the basics is the most important ones to be, exactly. uh, to be, yes, sir. So Gautam, coming, coming as an FMG student, then yes. joining up orthopedics uh, DNB, and you just did not pass, you killed it. You did not pass, man, you killed it. I, I know it's huge to score the score that you got at 180 out of 300 in DNB. Remember the lining that yeah, I told you to tell us, every day you must study. Yes, sir. Keep revising, keep understanding, whatever you see, read about it, whatever you operate, read the approach and then go back. I hope that you keep contributing to this wonderful branch of orthopedics. I hope the pain of the patients is healed through your hands. I hope this name Gautam Sena, Dr. Gautam Sena, right? Everybody in this nation and abroad remembers. And I wish that Thank you, sir. on behalf of the family of conceptual orthopedics, which you are a part your name should rise and shine forever. May you live to glory. Thank you, sir. God bless you. Thank you, sir. Congratulate Thank you. your family on our behalf. Bye, Gautam. Thank bye you, bye. sir. Thank you very much, sir. Bye. Bye. Okay, bye-bye, sir. Thank you, sir.